Hey everybody, Robert here. So, um, I don't know, a couple of months ago, I put in an application to be an Amazon Associates um, so I could use affiliate links through Amazon, which is one of the ways that uh, you can earn some money when you monetize a blog or a YouTube channel or anything else. Well, last week, I received um, an email from them. They had rejected my application for my a to z smarthome.com domain due to trademark violations and uh, i was a little confused by that so i read through their uh, trademark policy went through my website and the blog information i didn't see anything that was um, in violation of their policies at all um, I did reach out to uh, Greg Gottfried, who um, who has the YouTube affiliate marketing course that I have linked. Um, and he looked at my blog and didn't see anything either. But he said he did a little deeper digging and discovered that Amazon has trademarked A to Z. <laughs> so I was like, oh, okay. Um, I did submit a review to Amazon, and sure enough, when they replied, that uh, that was it. They said I could not use that URL, um, and that's why they rejected my application, because it violates the trademark that they have for A to Z. So, I would never have thought that. Um, I did do some search in the beginning before I bought that domain to make sure there's nothing else using it and that, you know, there didn't seem to be any other issues, but I didn't do any kind of like trademark, you know, research, uh, because I would not have thought that A to Z would have been trademarked at any rate. So it brings me to a dilemma of what do I do? Um, I can continue to use A to Z smarthome.com for my blog and also my YouTube channel run the risk of them actually submitting a cease and desist to me to say, stop using that domain altogether. And of course I would not be able to have any Amazon associates affiliate links. So I could not earn any money through the Amazon um, program, which would be detrimental because that's a lot of products they have that, you know, you can pretty much get anything under the sun through Amazon. So I have a domain called Cloud9 Technologies. Um, it's cloud9tech.com, but with a K, not an H at the end, because unfortunately Cloud9 Tech, T-E-C-H, was taken, uh, but that's all right. Um, so I decided to go ahead and use that domain and rebrand everything. So I have all of my blog information and website information moved over. And I have just finished completing the migration of the YouTube channel so I can move it into a branded account and then add the Cloud9 Tech domain as primary owner. Um, and then once all that process is done, I'll probably completely um, eliminate the A to Z smart home domain altogether. Um, I have already resubmitted an application to Amazon Associates for cloud9tech.com and I'm hoping not to have any issues with that because that has nothing to do with Amazon. Um, I did do some research on that. I didn't find anything. So uh, we'll see what happens. But kind of the point of all this is that you're going to run into roadblocks and you're going to run into these speed bumps that are going to create you some problems. Um, and the thing is to find the solution to the problem. And then once you find the solution, execute the solution and move forward. Um, nothing ever goes exactly as planned, it seems. And it's really on how you manage it that's going to determine whether you're successful or not. You can let the problem control you or you can control the problem. Um, so that's my solution. Yes, it has set me back a little bit. Um, yes, I'm going to have to redo all my old affiliate links because they no longer work, but that's okay. It's just time. I'll be able to get through uh, that process uh, relatively in short order. 
Um, so anyways, I just kind of want to give you know, a little word of encouragement that if you're running into these stumbling blocks, that just move forward. Um, if you have any comments or questions, please put them into the comments section below. I'd sure like to hear them. And um, if I can help in any way, I would be more than happy to do that as well. Uh, don't forget to give the uh, video a thumbs up. And if you could subscribe to the channel, that would be awesome. Uh, kind of help get it off the ground. And uh, as always, I appreciate you guys watching and we'll catch you next time.